If you want to learn how we've sent over 10,000 emails just in the last three months with a 61% open rate, stick around and I'll show you exactly how we did it. Something we all need as business owners is new leads and new people to sell to. So how are we contacting this many people and what is the backend system set up to be? What we have to do is scale horizontally. And what I mean by that is we have one main domain and then have several email accounts under that domain all tied to it. Just in this one instantly account that I just showed you at the beginning of the video, we have 10 sending accounts from this one domain. But with all that being said, this is exactly how we go ahead and reach that sort of volume. Let's go ahead over to either Cloudflare or GoDaddy. For this example, I'm gonna use GoDaddy because it integrates really easily with Instantly. But let's go ahead and pick the sending domain that we want to go ahead and send from and what that means is pretty much say for example you've probably seen custom domains it could be like frank at uh, buildingsolutions.com in that case buildingsolutions.com would be the domain that they have bought and then they go ahead and add their own custom name at the beginning of that to make it personalized and professional so for this i'm assuming you're in some sort of software space if you're watching this go high level video so let's go ahead and do something like uh no code software solutions now this is not the best email or best domain to pick but i'm going to be going ahead and searching for it and using it for the example here so it's actually available for one cent for the first year under godaddy once you decide at which sort of domain you want to go ahead and start sending from we're going to go ahead to a page it's going to look like this and go to the email tab and it says create a professional email address for your domain now for me i actually bought this domain which is going to be another sending account for pushing my credit card burn private processing offer so what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to end up getting 10 of these custom kind of open or sending domains. And I'm going to put names like for, you know, Frank at card processing system.com, uh, will at credit card processing.com. You get the gist. You can make unlimited accounts of that. Now to do this, it's pretty cheap. And as you can see, you know, up front, it's going to be two bucks per month per user. And then once you go ahead and renew it, it's going to be $6 a month. So it'll add up a little bit as you go ahead and scale more and more horizontally. Nothing too crazy, but it's definitely worth the money because if you go ahead and close the deal, that deal is gonna pay for quite literally everything. So, you know, I wanna bring this up as well. There's somebody I'm talking to that is sending 25,000 emails per day. So if you think that the volume you're sending is enough, I promise you it's not, and there's other people out there that are pushing harder than you. But now once you have your professional email that looks something like this and you make whatever name you want to be ahead, you know, before the at, Let's go ahead and navigate over to Instantly. Now, once we're under the email accounts tab, and you know, once you've walked through and set up your entire Instantly account, we're gonna go ahead and go over to Add New. Now, what's gonna happen is you're gonna wanna go ahead and go to Microsoft Office 365 and link this account. I can't add it because I already have my account added, but you know, if you are new to it, you do wanna go ahead and make a new Microsoft account. Uh, Microsoft for Outlook because it's just super compatible and super easy to sync up with this. You don't want to do I am mapping or I personally don't even use Gmail for, for G Suite for this for instantly at least because you got to do a few more things in the DNS settings and it's just more annoying. But the whole gist of this is to rinse and repeat that same process until you have, you know, multiple, multiple sending accounts within your campaign. And then something a lot of people don't do or don't do properly is do a proper warm up for emails. So for example, this one is actually new, 112 email warm-ups were sent last week so what is an email warm-up uh what does that even mean what does it look like so whenever you buy a new email sending account pretty much you want to start it for like a two to three week warm-up sequence and you actually always want to have emails warmed up um, because basically what it does is, is it helps email health and it reduces your chance of going to spam and then just being marked as spam and other people's inboxes so it basically helps account health and for anyone that's wondering like oh, how many emails should i be sending per day per account i don't recommend going over 50 to 60 per account per day because at that point you're really going to start pushing the risk of you being marked as spam i know there's people out there that are sending more honestly per account we know we have as you can see 99 percent health 95 98 96 percent health on you know thousands and thousands and thousands of emails sent out so you know we're doing something right to keep our email health correct uh and you know i, I want to make sure you guys are doing the same thing as well so now since we have all of this stuff scaled out horizontally how are we getting leads i'm not going to go into that this video i'm going to just touch on it briefly here because 
that could be its own video for a different day. Essentially, you can either scrape emails from other platforms. You can actually even go into Instantly and look at stuff. You can just look at leads inside of Instantly. And as you can see, we can see their LinkedIn account here, who they are, you know, per, what their email is, their phone numbers, their, where they're at, how many employees are here, what industry they're in. So you get the gist. You guys can do all different kinds of things. And there's actually 136,000 people. That's only that's actually 5,000 pages. So that's insane. <laughs> but you can go ahead and scrape stuff however you want. Upload a CSV file to your campaign here and then just start shelling them out while warming up your campaign. There's tons of ways to do it. There's no one right way to do it. But the whole gist of it is to go ahead and scale horizontally, upload a campaign of leads that have already been pre-qualified in terms of validating their emails. And what I mean by validating their emails, I mean by uploading that CSV file to some sort of email verifier or, or email checking software, because a lot of emails that you're going to wind up getting are either just old, out of use, and your emails are going to land in their spam inbox or just not deliver. So we want to ensure that your deliverability is also going to be solid because if you then go ahead and start sending emails to a bunch of people and say like 20 to 30% are like not delivering, that's a really bad problem. That's going to cause really bad health for all of your email accounts that are linked under the domain that you've bought. But if you want to see a video on how to intrigue someone to open your message and actually respond, Go ahead and drop a comment and just say that you want to go ahead and watch that video. And if you are new to high level, go ahead and check the description. I have an entire free course just for you starting as a complete beginner to going ahead and building an entire SaaS agency business or some sort of online business. You can turn it into whatever you want. Just go ahead and start the high level 30 day free trial. There's nothing up front. I promise you guys you'll get all access to my course and be able to utilize everything inside of high level here. But check out the video on screen if you haven't seen it already all about high level as well to help you start your entire go high level journey. Hope you learned something new here and apply it to your business. But with that being said, I'll see you in the next video.